Okay, welcome to the personal property tour for 10 North Wind in Collinsville. It's an amazing two bedroom mid terrace property finished at a high standard inside, even as a box room to the front there. You can have the perfect home office as well. Back garden is absolutely amazing. The views at the rear, and I'm going to show you them, so hang on till the end uh, what they're like. And I'll actually show you the views from the top of this window across to the golf course, at uh, the Charlton Golf Course over there as well. Yeah, if golf's your thing, this has got to be the place to be. It is nice and central for everything. And I will talk about all the amenities and what's on your doorstep in this area towards the end of this video. Let me flip the camera around. Big bonus for this, it's away from the main road. And it's in a cul-de-sac setting as well, which is ideal. So basically, you've got parking all the way around here. You've also got parking away around there and away around the corner over there as well. So it's easy parking uh, across here. Now, you've got a pen up to the side, which takes you down to the back garden. We'll show you a bit more where that gate is to the rear of the garden. And then in here, as we go in the front door, we're going to pop upstairs first. Uh, but good entrance vestibule. You've got places for cloaks and shoes and boots. Um, so it's ideal for that. If you've got a pet, you could clean them up here before you get into the main house. We'll go up and see the two double bedrooms up here, the bathroom and the box room, which is the ideal for a home office. But remember when I said it was finished a high standard? Yep, just take one look at that. Beautiful, isn't it? Lovely bathroom. So you've got a bath and you've got a, sh a thermostatic shower overhead with a rainfall shower in there. And then you've got your sink and set into your a unit there and your WC freestanding uh, with your chrome radiator behind the door. Ideal, isn't it? Bet you didn't expect that. Um, so, double bedroom first off to my side here. Currently utilised as a nursery. As you'll see. And here's the payoff at the rear garden, like I said before. We'll get there when we get out in the back. Look at that. Look at where it looks. No one behind you. Ideal. Protected from elements, by the way, as well. And then we go into the next double bedroom. One thing this has got, by the way, is storage. Storage covered in here. Combi condenser boiler in there, by the way. Storage up there as well. You've got that big shed out the back, which is great for storage. Um, and then you've got the double bedroom to the front here. So again, another good sized double bedroom. Uh, you can see two freestanding wardrobes here and also a chest of drawers. And you've got your bed as well. And you've got units as well. So it is a really good sized room. Let me talk about the area, um, actually, I'll just point out to the front because I said I was going to do that. See, there's all the parking in here, as you can look all the way around. But then also you've got the Charlton Estate over there, which is the golf course. So Charlton Golf Course is over there. You've got the estate over there if you've got dog walking, if you're mountain biking or you're walking or just running as well. Hill running's maybe your thing. It could be ideal for out here as well. Um, and then across the back for road cycling. The back roads and the B roads are really good. Uh, and I'll talk about more where it is in proximity to all the locations over there. And then finally, the bonus upstairs is your wee home office area. So, box room. But, ideal home office. Set up. I did my accountancy study in, in something a lot smaller, believe it or not. So this is ideal for someone. If, if you're um, um, working from home, especially if you're working from home, I would say. One last look at that bathroom. Wait till you see the kitchen. Wait till you see the kitchen. Even better. Okay, so downstairs, what I love about this is the open plan. Uh, living room to dining room at the rear. So really good sized living room at the front here. And then you go across to the rear here and you've got the dining room area. Now you can see the dining room table and chairs. There's about, you know, four chairs you can comfortably fit there. So it just shows you the length of that. You could easily fit that in there again. So this tells you you can get about maybe 10 or 12 people in here if you really had a, t a, a, t a table that was extendable um, for entertainment, Christmas, Christmas and things like that. Yeah, I have mentioned it, Christmas. Um, and we'll go at the back and we'll see this from the front and you can see it like that. From the front itself. So I'm sure you'd agree, plenty of space here. Overall, perfect start at home, isn't it? Definitely, in my opinion. Um, kitchen, breakfast and kitchen. Yeah, just as you thought you couldn't get any better, breakfast and kitchen. <laughs> it's unusual to get breakfast and kitchens in you know, a property like this, but it's ideal and it's beautifully finished. So, breakfast bar here, plenty of cupboard space all the way around. You've got your oven, you've got your induction hob, you've got your extractor above. You've got an integrated dishwasher and also a freestanding um, space for a freestanding uh, washing machine. And then behind the door, you've got your fridge and freezer there as well. 
But again, beautifully finished kitchen. In here. LED lighting. Oh, and the kicker boards and actually under counter as well. That look really nice at night. And then a, another bonus. I'm looking forward to sitting over there. Beautiful sun trap. So there's that gate to the side that shows you the pen um, and you get access into like I showed you at the front. And then you've got your shed, which is loads of storage. You'll get mountain bikes in there. You'll probably get a kayak or two in there as well if you want. If you're, and you know, because I'll tell you where you are in proximity to, to the coast. Uh, and then a perfect seating area to the rear. The great thing is this is nice low maintenance. That's what I like, low maintenance. No much effort to do anything. No major upkeep. <laughs> but the perfect sun trap in here. And then you've got these views to the rear, which is what I like about this as well. Great, isn't it? Primary school's just over there, by the way. So just, hey, you could probably nip over the wall to the primary school <laughs> if you've got children. <laughs> and then there's the property as well. And as I said, the sun trap. Uh, so let me tell you where the sun comes up and goes down. We're sitting at around about half 11 now. So 12 o'clock's south facing there. Um, so it comes up over here in the morning, travels all the way around. But look at the height of the sun right now. So it'll easily clear that roof, uh, easily. So you'll still get the sun on here in the evening. Hello, Pussycat. So beautiful sun trap. And the great thing is once you sit down here, and I'm going to sit down, ah, you're protected from the elements. Let me talk about the area for anybody that doesn't know where this is in proximity to anything. I talked about Charlton Golf Course, but if you're a golfer, this is your thing. Uh, Dumbarney Lynx is just along the road, about a couple of miles. Um, that's where all the Hollywood stars, Tom Holland was there recently, and a lot of the professionals actually play in the Lynx. You've got Lundy Lynx Golf Course as well, uh, which is further along, which was used in an open qualifying championship course for the open qualifying in St Andrews. And then you've also got easy access down to Ely. So uh, that's when you're getting into the beach and the coastal path and harbours and, and everything that's lovely about the East Nuke. Um, so easy access into Ely and then you're further along you can get into um, um, you can get to St Monans, you can get into um, Pitt and Weem and then you're the Arts and Crafts at Pitt and Weem and then you're along to Anstruther which is the main uh, high school at Wade Academy and then some of the main shopping facilities are over there as well. There's a convenience store over the road here at the end of this just in the end of the road here in this convenience store uh, you save you can get in uh, for your bits and pieces for you know just morning stuff that you're needing okay so great walk, walk, walk routes great cycling routes overall uh, great lifestyle choice um, if you're needing st andrews 10 miles over the hill you can pop over there you can come back here as well and uh, so overall a fantastic lifestyle choice could be a perfect start at home for someone. It could be the perfect place for someone that just wants to work from home remotely or has a business that works from home as well because of that box room at the front. Uh, there's further details on this post. You can click on the link above or below for the photographs and the descriptions. If you need to contact us, you can message us direct on this post or you can contact us on 01 421 774. Until next time, guys, I'm Jim Parker for Five Properties. TV. I think I'm just going to bask in the sun a wee bit longer. <laughs> it's fantastic. Bye bye for now.